Are there particular initiatives uh, that, or, or uh, projects that, that have been incubated or nurtured uh, within the Paris Peace Forum? Uh, maybe a couple that you're particularly interested in? Let me uh, give you perhaps one, uh, 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 one example, uh, one that we're trying to uh, 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 sort of uh, to, to accelerate that we've launched just in November is the one on critical minerals. And I, I'm picking this one because uh, it's one that uh, is a good example of the uh, trade-off or, or the difficulties of navigating geopolitics and global governance. So, so the starting point is we all know that in order to survive, uh, we need to do the green transition. We also all know that in order to do the green transition, we'll need a mass of minerals that we need to extract from the earth in order to get the electric vehicles, the solar panels, and all the infrastructure of electrification. Uh, uh, and, uh, and, and it's true also for the digital transition. So they will, it's estimated that we'll extract from the earth as much minerals uh, as we've done in the next 30 years as we've done since the beginning of humanity. So the, the quantities are enormous. So, Basically, we're replacing a geopolitics of oil and gas right, exactly. with a geopolitics mm -hmm. of, of minerals. And this issue will only grow. So if you take a step back, uh, you could say, OK, so let's try to do this right. That is to say, let's make sure that we have enough minerals, that we don't jeopardize the, uh, 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 the green transition, uh, and that we, we manage to go to a net zero uh, uh, situation. Uh, let's try to not make it a geopolitical stake. Uh, so that uh, uh, it's not a motive for wars as oil, you know, whether we like it or not, has been uh, uh, an important uh, uh, motive for, uh, for wars. And let's make sure that we don't replace a problem, which is uh, uh, global warming and, and too many CO2 emissions, with another problem, right. which was spoiling the environment with right. uh, you know, know, mines trying, trying to mining deep sea nodules and, yeah, destroy, exactly. and destroying the exactly. deep seabed or, or you know, sensitive um, sensitive environmental issues on in the terrestrial world. Exactly.